Hey Daniel, what do you want to do today? Well, first of all, I want to have another day of hot girl summer. And then, dude, we're going to paddle and we're just going to have a good time. Good all vibes, right. bro. Let's go paddleboard. Four paddle boards, a couple coolers, a sunshade, Chez, Bailey, Danny. It's going to be a good day. All right, you heard Danny today. We're making paddleboarding happen. We are out here at Jordan L State Park in Utah. It's about 45 minutes outside of Salt Lake City around there, right near Park City, about 10, 15 minutes past Park City, up part of these canyons. So you get here, it's about $20 to enter for day use. There's some other little fees there as well. Yeah, we got here, it's mid-July. The lake's pretty low, but it's looking good still. Still a lot of area to have fun. The beach is huge, so you can find some good real estate there. So yeah, we came and set up camp pretty easy. Got a nice little uh, sunshade over there. All right, me and Dan, you're gonna have a paddleboarding blow-up competition to see who can blow it up first. Got anything to say? That's what she said. <laughs> We were gonna have the paddleboarding blow up competition. Ches wanted to join in as you saw. And then we actually got some uh, good Samaritans, some nice friends from Washington came up and like, hey, you want help pumping up your stuff? We got these awesome tools. I don't know if you watched, but uh, I ended up winning. I was the only one with a single action pump. They both had two way pumps and uh, got it. Anyways, it is a state park, so you need a life jacket if you go out beyond the buoy. So make sure you grab one of those. Make sure to load up, get your favorite playlist ready to go. There is cell service out here. So you can put your waterproof speaker on your board. Should be fun. We're gonna get to it. How you doing everybody? How you doing guys? It went out a little bit. There was a, a water cop that came out. Got Danny for not wearing a life jacket. He didn't give him a ticket, but he said that uh, he couldn't even be out on the water without a life jacket. So just know that they're pretty, they're pretty hardcore with the rules here. But uh, then we got back to camp and the nice Samaritans from Washington State, Danny went and asked him if he could borrow a life jacket. And they said, here, have this one. Don't worry about it. Great people. Washington State, you guys are homies. Yeah, it's a great day out in the water, man. We're just hanging, we're just chilling. It's a good time. Taking a little dip. It's cold. Oh, it's cold, but it feels good. Anyways, just didn't come out, enjoy the lake, set up a camp. Woo. It is rocky. Bring some flip flops. Then it gets super muddy in the water. Don't wear the flip flops in because it'll suck them up. All right, we're playing some board roulette here. I got Danny's High Society. And that's pretty nice. Like, honestly, the deck's pretty cushiony. He doesn't like his paddle because he got a grain of sand jabbed in it. But uh, it's not bad. It's all right. Danny's looking fresh. Bailey Chez just hanging. It's a good day, man. It's a good day. Get out on the water. Wear a life jacket. Don't get caught by the cops. Have fun. So I feel like every time you go out paddleboarding, guys, you reach like a certain point when you're like, okay, I'm having a really freaking good time. Now's that point for me. Like, water's great. Vibes out. Good people, good vibes, good company. Go create your world, guys. Woo! Oh, that's not cold.
little bit. It's a little windy today, and so it just kind of pushes you out past the buoys around right here in the big boat wakes. So just kind of be careful of that. You know, watch where the, watch the buoys. Make sure you can get in. These boys want to do a plank competition, so uh, let's see how it goes. Three, two, one, go! Foot down! I'm just teasing you. Do what you want. All right, I quit. Chris hit me. What you do? <laughs> that as an excuse. First time paddleboarding, Bailey. How was it? Really good. Thumbs up. You don't have to be on YouTube if you don't want to. And progression from sitting to, to kneeling. Danny doesn't know how to paddle, so we're having a teaching moment with Chaz. Welcome to this week's segment, everybody. So he knows how to paddle, but we're just teaching him advanced turning. Remember, you're trying to turn. You paddle on this way, and you paddle on the left. You go right. Paddle on the right. You go left. But if you turn it backwards and push back, you go the way of the paddle. And Danny's learning how to my break. Life, my life is changing, buddy. Think Chez, paddle people. Teaching moments with Chez. Get a little wide. Like have your stance a little wider. Yeah. And just kind of like, you can kind of balance on your toes and your knees. And just kind of get comfortable with that. It's like you can just balance on your knees and you're good. So yeah, if you're trying to learn how to paddle board, that's the first step is you get on your knees, learn how to take the waves with that. Put your feet flat. Hey, good work. It's baby steps. You're doing awesome. Do you lie awake at night? Are you afraid to turn out the lights? Is there something you're scared of? back in about to pack up camp load the paddle boards in but i just wanted to come up here and talk to you guys for a minute and just say it's all about the little moments right there's just a little moment when you're out there you're standing the sun starts shining on you and you just feel like the king you just feel on top of the world and that's what makes a good day is if you have one of those moments one of those little moments it's a good day and for me i get out there and i feel it every time i go paddle boarding there's just one of those small moments and that's what i talk about creating your world creating those moments of joy in a life that you want to remember so what does it for you what where do you get those little moments sometimes you get them hiking too you get those beautiful mountain views comment down below and say when was the last time you had a little moment where you're like life is good comment down below and say what you were doing and that way we can all give it a try you know go out and have, find those moments for ourselves and so that's my challenge to you is to write down what inspires you what do you want to do what are those little moments comment down below let me know what you think anyways we're gonna go get packing All right, got the truck all loaded up, everything taken up from the beach. What a day, what a day. Jordan L State Park, awesome day. Bring some homies along, get you a good homie like Chez that drives us up here. Shout out to him for being awesome. We're in the back seat, 
Anyways, hope you guys had fun. If you had fun today, remember to click subscribe. It goes a long way to support the channel. You don't know how much it does, uh, but it was a good day. Everyone got going. People stood up for the first time. So if you like this video, make sure to watch some of the other ones. We've done Kazi Reservoir, which was awesome. Check that one out. Be sure to check that one out. Tibble Fork is also a sweet spot. Check that video out. Share a special moment that you had, that small little moment in the day that made it perfect. And uh, go create your world. Go create the ideal Saturday that we just had. Go create the world. <laughs>